Hello and welcome back to my second video. Um, today I did this natural go-to everyday look. Um, yeah, I really like the way it came out. I think it's really easy to do. And this is what most girls wanted to see when I asked what you guys wanted for my second video. So this is what I came up with. It's a really easy, neutral look. And if you want to see how I created this, just go ahead and keep on watching. With the line at the bottom and then kind of blend it up and then line at the top and then just kind of blend it all in. So that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, now to cleaning up the brows. I did this one off camera. So, um, to clean them up, I use my paint pot from MAC in the shade Soft Ochre. Wow, that's upside, that's backwards, sorry. But, um, it looks like this. And I like this one because it's more of a yellow tone. There's another one that's really popular, but that one's like gray. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of it. So I just um, take some of that on a synthetic brush. So now that the eyebrows are done, I'm just going to set um, my eyelids with just a white um, eyeshadow. Something like this. And that'll just help keep it from creasing. And since this is a really um, natural, everyday look, I don't use too much color so the color that I am just um 
gonna use is it's gonna be this one right here and I'm just gonna take a blending brush and just take some of the product and just put that on my lid outer corner and then bring it into the crease eyeshadow on the obviously on the eyelid and on the bottom lash line I used the same exact color I didn't add any other colors and now I'm just gonna put some mascara and do the eyeliner so for mascara I'm just using this voluminous carbon black mascara by L'Oreal and I'm just gonna apply a coat of that really quick now we're gonna go ahead and do the eyeliner I am gonna be doing liquid eyeliner and I am using this Italia eyeliner and I'm just gonna go ahead and I start off with um I always start off I do like the wing the wing and then I just connect them to be honest, I just try and make sure that they're even. There's not really much to it. I just try and make sure that the wings are even and then just connect them. So, just going to go ahead and start right here. Just kind of bring it up towards the end of my brow. There's one wing. And I'm going to do the same thing with the other side. And doesn't look too bad. It looks pretty even to me. And now I'm just going to connect. I'm going to choose any point from the line depending on how thick and stuff you want it. So I just kind of go about here and just bring it down.
So while the glue dries on the eyelashes, I'm just going to um, do my brow highlight. I totally forgot about that. And I'm just using um, the Modern Renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm using this gold can't really tell that it's gold right here but it's kind of like a gold shimmery color and i'm just gonna put that right under the brow and make it pop eyelash <laughs> my eyes and brows all done so now I'm just gonna move on to the face and it's literally the same um, face routine that I always do so we'll start off with our professional primer and just run that through my whole face <laughs> And we're mixing these two again. Okay, so I mixed the two foundations and I'm just putting that all over my face. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and blend it all out with my beauty blender. <laughs> I'm using the Laura Mercier Mercier whatever translucent powder again and I'm just gonna put that all over my face and bake as well because it's gonna be a long work day today so I'll just do a thin layer of this all over my face and then let some of it sit in the areas where I get most oily.
So while that's baking, I am going to take this um, angled brush and my bronzer, my NYX matte bronzer, and just kind of contour and bronze at the same time with this. So I just um, took off the powder, the baking, and now I'm just going to put a little bit of blush. I'm just going to use a really light pinky blush on the apples of my cheeks. And I'm going to do some highlight. I'm just going to be using, where did I put it? Oh, I'm using the Carly Bybel Cosmetic, Carly Bybel and BH Cosmetics palette, and I just like to use these two. I just mix them. taking a lip gloss. It's a nude lip gloss. We'll just set our face with some setting spray. Okay, so this is the look that I came up with. I literally just, um, I think it looks cute. It's simple, very, very simple. Um, yeah, this is what you guys wanted to see, though. You guys wanted something natural and neutral, everyday look. So that's what I did. Um, so just go ahead and let me know what other ideas you guys have for my next videos. I have things in mind, but I obviously want to do what you guys want to see. So yeah, just stay tuned on my YouTube channel for more videos like this. And go ahead and like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching once again, and I'll see you guys in my next video.